and rapid advice from Chez on the saxophone. Um, C sharp. <laughs> that is a note, isn't it? Yeah. Um, C sharp, no fingers. It's just a really volatile note. The tuning on it is a bit of a nightmare. To be honest, B is as well, but there's not as much you can do with B. So I'm going to talk about C sharp because at least there are some things you can do. So, um... First of all, let's look at the tuning issue. So in the lower register, this is me personally, I mean, you need to sit down with a, a tuner and work out what's going on with your intonation on your C-sharps, but my C-sharp in the middle register uh, is really flat. Uh, my middle side key, because it's opening a hole, will just raise it up a little bit for me. Did I just show you the difference? So if I know that I'm going to be holding a C sharp for any length of time and I want the tuning to be good, I'm going to stick that button on. In the upper register, however, it's really sharp. I put all of my right hand down, this hand here. Uh, hopefully you can hear that getting just a smidge flatter for me. If yours is really, really sharp, I think you can actually get, can you get, mm, hang on. Yeah, you can get away with taking your ring finger in your left hand as well if it's really, severe situation and um, depends on your saxophone so there's the tuning the other issue uh, is crossing the break it's really noisy uh, the saxophone is just quite a noisy instrument really especially if you're cat handed like me I've got massive man hands um, so really quick tip you can go from your D to your C sharp by literally keep your octave key on and everything keep all of your D on but just remove your index and your middle finger like this, I will show you. And uh, you can move quickly without making so much flipping noise. If you were just doing a twiddle, you might want to use your shortest palm key and that stops you having to go. Another little trick, quick tip there. Hope that was useful and I will see you in the next video. If you haven't already subscribed, you should. Bye.